What's up everyone, my name is Swift Edge, and welcome to the demo for Fear the Spotlight, a game that I didn't really read too much into the summary, which is kind of weird for me, I usually always do that, but I don't know why I did. I looked at the promotional images, and one of the things that stuck out to me was the fact that the main character that we're playing as is underneath, I think like a desk or a table or something, and there's just this big spotlight. But it's not being carried by anything, it looks like it could be someone's head that is walking around and one of the things that is noted for this game is that it's third person gameplay but it's also stealth gameplay because we have to sneak past the monster because we cannot fight back and that when going through and just taking quick glances all that was like mm, mm hmm we're gonna go ahead and play this and we're gonna have ourselves a spooky good time are you ready too bad if you're not we're starting it my friend Amy was supposed to meet me in the library after school but she never showed up. Hmm, how peculiar. Was she talking about the monster with a potential spotlight for her head? Was uh, that what happened to Amy? Oh, I had to click. I searched and found her wandering into a section of the school that was burned down years ago. Why is it that if buildings have decayed parts of it, they don't prune it? It's kind of like branches on a tree that you have to prune, whether to keep fruit actually coming in, whether to actually keep it budding very well why is it that buildings the people that look after those buildings don't take care of it and just prune those sections either rebuild them or just demolish them i don't know why that's a common theme in a lot of horror games and a lot of shows that there's like these broken down parts of buildings or whatever and people never deal with them i don't know why someone please explain that to me i know i'm not supposed to go in here but something is up with amy and i have to find her do you though do you actually because i don't think you do i really don't think you do Oh, and of course, it, what? Oh, I like that. I like the fact that you look on a different direction and the character's actually shifting with the flashlight. Control is to do that, right? Yeah, and the fact that the door's already locked. How do we get in here? That is my question. Can we hide? Um, oh my gosh. I know you're here somewhere. Where are you? I'm going to find you, my little starlet. That's a big spotlight for a head. Good lord. Wow. Just threw me right in there, huh? I thought I saw something shiny over here. Oh, oh, it's doing that style. I love it. I freaking love it. Ooh, what is this? It's an inhaler. This will be helpful in my if my health is ever low and my lungs need some relief. Ooh, are they using inhalers for that? Dude, that's so cool. Letter for Amy. It's the letter I was going to give to Amy, but she never showed up at the library. It is nice and shiny. I can use whatever I'm I like that. Uh, what is this? Looks like a poster used to be up here. There's a pl placard underneath that reads a fate split between death and love. Oh, <gasps> it's a puzzle. It's a puzzle. I love it. Love it. It's a tube with a poster in it. The poster is for a school play. It has a picture of a skull and a boy's face on it. I think I found the poster. Yes, it fits. But is it the right one? Looks like a poster used to be up here. There's a placard underneath that reads Spied Lovers Meeting. Uh, I don't think that all the posters are in here. Nope. Unfortunately. Oh, I can also use space to do that. That's uh, good to know. Ooh, there is another poster in here. Whoa! Wait, no, that's just a note. There's a handwritten note. Hey, Melissa, I stole the drama room key like you asked. I have it stashed in my locker in the journalism class. The combo is your birthday. Will you go with me to the movies now like you promised? Hmm, this kid really liked Melissa. What's his birthday? That's my question. Looks like a poster used to be up here. There's a placard underneath that reads a dazzling performance. I'm assuming for me to actually be able to open that door. I need to put all the posters. There's no lock on the door, but it won't budge. Strange. Because I'm pretty sure I have to get the posters. It's going to be one of those kind of puzzles. And I like it. I like those kind of puzzles. 
So we have to find a journalism room to find a key. And we also have to find what Melissa's birthday is. It's a bulletin board. It's mostly filled with school flyers with some boring announcements. There's a single photo of a group of students with their teacher. Below the photo, it reads, Drama Club, Mr. Crane. Is Mr. Crane the spotlight monster? Is he the spotlight monster? I have a bad feeling he's the spotlight monster. Can the monster see my flashlight? Oh gosh, the music. Mr. Crane, trauma class, the door is locked. Ah, oh, I need the key. I can't run. Oh, the tension. I love it. It's just so amped up. Okay, well that's locked. That's the only other door besides this one and the one over there. Can we open up this one? Journalism class. Oh, here we go. Ooh, is this the... This locker is locked. Looks like I can open it with the right combination. I don't know the birthday, though. That's the thing. Said so it's Melissa's birthday. I might need to find a card. Ooh, what is this? It's a clipboard that reads, Please provide your birthday so we can include you on the monthly birthday celebrations. Kate, Bobby, Melissa, 0517. Great. Love it. It's a tube with a poster in it. The poster's for a school play. It has a picture of two people holding hands on it. That's probably for the spy lovers meeting. But we have 0517 so we can actually unlock this locker. What's going to be in it, though? I can't remember. <laughs> ADHD people things come and go out of my brain all the time that's why I have to look at stuff all the freaking time what is this jackpot I'm in it's a key with an engraving that says drama class yeah baby what is this it's an old projector looks like the power switch still works but the light bulb inside isn't turning on I could, bet I could fit the, fix this projector with the right materials I don't know you want to use this doesn't help me here. I need to figure out how to fix this thing if I want to use it. Well, I don't have tools. It's a handwritten note that reads, Did you hear? Amber got sick, so now Chrissy is getting the lead in the play. Of course we get skipped over for the part. Ugh. I convinced Bobby to steal the drama room key so we can ruin her costume. He's a, such a sucker for me. I guess bullies exist in every generation. Uh, yeah. Who is it? Oh, don't, is, it's either, I'm calling it right now, I think it's Bobby that's the other spotlight guy, or it's Mr. Crane that's the spotlight guy. That's my thought. I'm, I'm going with that. What is this? It's a school newspaper, it reads, Sunnyside News, the premiere of The Phantom of the Opera will be coming this fall. We interviewed the teacher in charge of production, Mr. Crane, about the show. I can't believe this school had a newspaper and drama club. They didn't bring these back after the fire, probably because of some horrific events and they just wanted to forget about it and leave it. It's an inhaler. Sweet. I have a feeling, though, if that monster gets me, I'm just screwed. I have to get to that classroom. I just gotta, I just gotta go in there. Ooh, oh my gosh. I was silent because I was like, I just gotta focus on getting to that room. There's a bunch of old scripts and stuff for the theater class. There's a bunch of pictures of the students too. They look like they're having fun. Wait, is this my friend Amy in here? There's so many pictures of here, of her. Wait a second. No, this can't be her. These pictures are dated for 25 years ago. Wow, sure look, looks like her though. Weird. Maybe Amy's this the spitting image of her mom? Oh. Or maybe you're friends with a ghost. I don't, I don't know. Have you hung out with Amy outside of school? It's a script for a school rendition of the Phantom of the Opera. On the cover it reads, starring Amber. The name Amber is crossed out and written above is Chrissy. Yeah, it's because Amber was no longer able to take the part. So Chrissy took over. You know, when you have a monster that's roaming the halls looking for you, probably best not to play a really loud instrument. Okay. It's a photo of the school, but there's something odd about it. Looks like there's something behind it. 
What the? There's a panel back here. It's shut tight. I'll need some way to remove these screws if I want to search behind the panel. Do I look like I have a screwdriver? All I have is tubes for posters. It's a tube with a poster in it. The poster's for a school play. It has a picture of a girl on a stage. Looks like a bunch of awards for the drama teacher. It must be old since... We don't ha even have a drama class anymore. This one says teacher of the year. There's a yearbook snippet for the dreamiest teacher. And it goes on. Why do you have the power of the sun? Oh no, it's that thing again. I need to find a way out of this room. I need to sneak past without letting it, without letting it see me. Ow. That hurt a lot. Yo, are my lungs good? So it doesn't run at me, it just uses its beam to hurt. Oh god. I don't know how I did that. But I got the posters. So... How is it not just gonna walk back out of that hole and come right after me? Hmm? How is it not going to do that? A monster, I think, is a little dumb. Spied lovers meeting. A uh, poster of two people holding hands. I'm gonna go with this one. Yes, it fits. I'm hoping that these are all the right ones. I'm pretty sure they are. Uh, a dazzling performance. Yes, it fits. And they're open! I did it. The doors are open. This must be where Amy has gone. I hope she's okay. Well, we didn't get to mess with the projector and open up the panel! Is that for only full game stuff? That's probably full game stuff, isn't it? No! I wanted to say more! <laughs> you bastard! <laughs> Good job! You got me tasting it, and I wanted more of it. Fear the spotlight is being made by just two people. That's us. Hello. It means the world that you played our demo. We hope you enjoyed it. Two people just... The animations, the looks, and the style of it? Beautiful. The full version of Fear the Spotlight will be available in 2022. Please push 100% because I'm definitely going to be checking out the full game. I like that. I like the design of the creature. I like what the story is so far, which is just a girl who has wanted to find her friend. But now there's this big, huge mystery because her friend is in pictures that was 25 years ago. So something is amiss here. There's so much to impact. We're probably going to discover who Amy truly is and who the Spotlight monster is. And maybe something else. Who knows? But I'm definitely going to be checking out the full game when it arrives. But I want you to check out this demo. So click that link in the description below. Highly recommend that you do. If you enjoyed this, make sure to smash that like button. Leave a comment down below and let me know what you thought about this. If there's any games that you see me play for future videos or series, leave a suggestion down below. Take them all into consideration. And if you're new around here and you've been enjoying what you're seeing, why not click that subscribe button and click the bell so you get notified of my next video. I will see you all in the next one. Bye!